Keith, what kind of rattlesnake is this? Southern Pacific. Crotal, Southern. Crotalus orangonus hilari. Those two bites. And it's gone. And then to explain what the process is going on. Well, essentially this is neurotoxic, so it's, it's shutting down its nervous system. It's not allowing its, its nervous system to function. That's why the muscles are spazzing. Cardio will cease to exist. You can see the convulsions going up and down the spine. And uh, what is, um, now what would happen, how long would that take to affect, to a, human affect a human being? If that it depends it on the dose that's given to the animal. If the animal is able to give a full-blown injection, you could see, you will see um, side effects of the venom almost immediately after, let's say half an hour to an hour. And then how long would you say um, before the snake is ready to actually eat the the mouse? It usually gives it around 15 to 20 minutes to fully keel over. Sometimes they'll eat it sooner. Okay. And so another thing I've noticed is that sometimes the snakes are a little hotter than other times. Their venom really changes in quality over the over the weeks. You know, it depends on the temperatures and all that good stuff. So yeah, now she smells it. She's going for it. This uh, species is known to be hemotoxic. So I was talking to a guy online about it, and you know, there's really just no way to be tell to be sure. He suggested that it, it could be neurotoxic due to the way that the muscles are spasming. Cool, cool. And uh, people watching this on YouTube, uh, please read the long and lengthy uh, warning that I'm going to have my buddy uh, talking right now type up about this. And uh, hit the like button. Thank you.